95 or more percent of all the vines grown anywhere in the world are planted on American rootstock because it turned out there's your cure. And it's C.D. Riley and it's George Hussman and it's Isidore Bush and now Herman Jaeger who quickly figured this one out. They're like, well, you know, we coexist with the plant. So you graft our American rootstock with European vines. It's expensive, it's difficult, but it can be done and your plants will be fine. Your wine industry will, will uh, recover. It took decades for that to happen because it's a very expensive process. And we think millions of plants were shipped from Missouri by those four individuals to France, such that there is a statue in southern France to them uh, today, uh, and, and because it's understood they saved not just the French wine industry, but frankly, the wine industry. It was actually the Missouri State Entomologist, C.V. Riley, who completely uh, identified that it was the phylloxera that was causing this damage and this problem in European vineyards. So to counter it, they took two approaches, or two approaches evolved out of this. One was to graft the Vitus vinifera, European grape, onto Native American rootstocks. Underground, you had the Native American resistance, and above ground, you had the grape variety that they were used to growing in their areas. The other approach was to hybridize the two and come up with varieties that could grow on their own roots that were resistant. And that is how we got things like Vidal, Vignol, Chamberson, all these great hybrid varieties that do so well here in Missouri. So there was a huge effort by a lot of people, but the real hero was C.V. Riley. The French awarded him their Legion of Honor. They have statues to the man. It's incredible. C.V. Riley was not only great, um, we have an award named after him in our state industry um, for the best Norton, but he was also the first director of agriculture for our state as you they had an agricultural committee. So you started to see that state government then was starting to pay attention to these and he had a platform from um, helping to solve some of these issues. So he became important in agriculture as a whole in our state. Mm -hmm.